This video was possible thanks to Lightning, but more on that later. Hey guys, it's Brickogogo here, and welcome back to my channel for another video update. After 8 months, I finally decided to upload the end of this project. I intended to make a few videos about this project, but I didn't, so here's a quick recap of what I did with the airport. Let's go! I decided to go with this shape. I built the larger section, I was satisfied, so I placed air free 80s and it looks awesome. Then I used the same design to assemble the other buildings of the airport. Then I grabbed the bad light and he sent to me. While I install the lights, I will talk a bit about it. Oh my god! Lightning offers a lot of possibility with Lightning LEGO. You can order on their website light kits for LEGO sets, or you can pick special lights for your projects, such as an airport. The link is in the description below. The quality is good, and it really adds a lot to LEGO. So if you want to improve the LEGO sets you got on Christmas, that's the company you need. Perfection. Now back to the airport. I gathered all the grey base plates I have and many planes I built. If you want to build one of them, all tutorials are available on YouTube. I placed all the gates and here comes the magic trick. Your attention please. As I said, lights really improve the final look. Let's position all the planes and look at this. Now let me show you how astonishing it is when we switch off the lights. This is where the fun begins. Add a pillar to light the antenna section. Enjoy the film. I wish I had enough facts for the runway. Please subscribe for more. Bye.